welcome back to my channel so today I brought you guys a brow routine um, I know I have like all of my makeup on already but I really really wanted to um, film got lipstick all over here I really really wanted to film a brow tutorial for you guys I do it two type of ways um, I either do it with the Anastasia uh, dip brow pomade in dark brown or I usually fill them in with this LA Splash Cosmetics um, brow powder um, when I'm on the go and just like need to get out of the house fast five minutes ten minutes whatever um, I usually go with the powder but when I'm going out or I have like a event then I use the dip brow uh, so yeah I'm going to be showing you one side with the dip brow and one side with the powder. So I'm going to be using the same brush. And this one is, this one came with the, with this kit from LA Splash Cosmetics. And it also came with another color and a concealer and a highlighter. So it's really, really convenient and it wasn't that expensive. I got it at Ross, you know, finding cosmetics at Ross. Uh, but it actually works. It's really, 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 really um, cheap. So what I first do is that I start combing my eyebrows. Okay, so the next thing I do is that um, I'm going to be doing the dip brow on this side of my face and I'm going to be doing the brow powder on this side. So what I usually do is just dip my brush in here and just sweep up some product. And then what I like to do is start from the inside of my brow and take it out outwards. And just whatever you have left. Just start filling it. Fill start filling in the um the tail of your brow. And what you want to do is just keep lining it and filling in. That's just the trick. Just line and fill in, line and fill in. And then right here, you just want to bring your brush um, on the flat side and just sweep it up. It's kind of simple. Um, not, I don't have like a an actual perfect way of doing it. And then what if you if you mess up or have any extra product on one side you can just always clear it up it, like for example if you just did yours um, if you just did your your brows first then you can just wipe it off with the baby wipe or makeup removal wipe and then just conceal it just to highlight under and then I usually go with um, foundation on top because I don't want them to be so so highlight it on the top because then they look kind of weird so I just usually just um, cover, conceal them on the bottom of my brow sorry guys I'm having trouble talking today so just continue filling it in with whatever you have left Just grab a little bit more of the product just for that really, really precise um, end. And then just continue filling it in just with whatever product you have left to the beginning of your brow.
Okay, just like that. And then you can just go ahead and conceal the bottom part of your brow. If you're not, if you don't, if you just want it to stand out, I guess. Just conceal it. And then uh, for the other side, I'll be using the brow powder. So just put it like if your brush is dirty or whatever. And you want to use another one. I know I said in the video in the beginning that I was going to use the same one. But I'm not because, I mean, it already has product from the dip brow. And why am I going to use it to, to use it for the brow powder? So for the brow powder, I'm going to use another brush. And this one is uh, from BH Cosmetics. And this color is in the color Espresso. And it just looks like a dark brown, kind of. And then I grab some product and I tap off the excess. And then in the cap, I also tap off the excess again. And then what you want to do is basically the same thing. Just start lining it from the from the front and then just bring out the product outwards just like that and then just work with whatever product uh, you have left on the brush and whatever is left on the cap and just start filling them in now you want to grab some more and just tap off the excess on the cap and just continue filling them in I don't like to use pencil because when I shade them in with pencil, I feel like they they look too harsh or sometimes. So sometimes I just like want to skip that step. It's way easier, way natural with the um, powder. And if you guys don't are just like beginners, go ahead and give powder a try first. Um, and it's just, it looks way more natural. Um, and just bring out that arch. So. Yeah. Uh, you can really, really tell the difference between powder and the dip brow. So, you can see the difference of them. Um, I prefer powder for the most since it looks more natural. You no, know, I just like the, how, the way how the brow powder looks. Uh, so yeah, if you guys liked it, um, please give this a thumbs up, uh, like, comment, and subscribe more video ideas, um, you guys want to see. So yeah, hope you guys liked it. I'm not going to be showing you guys the concealing and stuff like that because it's really basic. So... So this is the finished look for both brows. Um, this was the dip brow and this was the powder. I hope that you guys liked this video. I hope it was helpful for you guys. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And then uh, comment down below any video suggestions that you guys might have for me. Um, I want to create more Halloween tutorials. Well, create Halloween tutorials because I haven't done any. So um, I'm going to do a tutorial on one of the Billy the Ventrologist dummy uh, from Dead Silence. I want to do it in a tutorial so if you guys are interested in that and want to see the tutorial um, just give this video a thumbs up or comment down below saying you guys want to see the video and I'll do the tutorial for you guys so yeah thanks for watching guys bye